So tomorrow we have some brand new AKA players in the game. And it starts off with A-Rod as Aaron Rodgers comes in the game tomorrow. Coming out of his darkness retreat thingy wingy he was in for four days. 97 overall with 84 speed, 97 throw power, 94 throw short, 97 throw middle, 94 throw deep, 98 throw under pressure, 97 throw in a run, 94 play action, and most likely he might be getting a 99 overall sometime in the next three or four weeks when it comes to his possible free agency promo because there's some rumors he might go to the Jets. There's some rumors he might go to the um, I think the Jets, the Raiders, the um, not Steelers, Jets, Raiders, and I think that's it. I think those two teams right now are the top two teams to get him. But yeah, so he might be getting a 99 overall in almost no time from now. So could see a really good card sometime soon. Especially because this card actually looks freaking amazing. Second guy. Yeah, no. Like, if there's ever a absolute no, 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 no when it comes to somebody's name, he is the guy that no. If he was a Baltimore Raven, I'd probably be able to say his name correctly. Kind of like Kyle Ushas, Klesio Semele, Sam Cook. Um, these are just some players people cannot say. Yannick Aguakwe. And trust me, there are players that because they're Ravens, I know how to say their names. He was never a Raven. So, not even a chance in heck. And also, his nickname is literally just his name, but with an O. So, it's not really a, you know. Anyway, 95 speed mill linebacker, 94 salvation, 90 strength, 92 tackle, 94 play rack, 97 block shed, 97 hit power, 92 zone coverage. With all being said, he's actually a pretty dang amazing card. Even with the whole no, 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 he's actually still a pretty dang good card. So, gotta give EA props on that. That's a W card right there, even if um, his name's impossible. I never knew Kyle Pitt's nickname was Unicorn. And I don't know how I feel about it. But, he is all limited time card, and... <laughs> He's going to be very comparable when it comes to speed. Very comparable to the free Rob Gronkowski we all have. Um, because he has 96 speed. But of course he doesn't have the run blocking ability. So he's worse than Gronkowski. But he does have 96 speed, 82 strength, 97 catching, 97 catching traffic, 96 back catch, 97 short route running, 96 medium route running, and 70 run block. So he's a freaking amazing card. If he had any kind of run block, he would be... Pretty much equivalent of Rob Gronkowski V2. And this would be a really nice one-two punch with Rob Gronkowski. Alright. So for the players. A-Rod. X-Factor gets Pro Reads 1 ability point. Um, brick Wall for 1 ability point. Ability Slots. Pass Lead Elite for 2 ability points. Hot Route Master. 2 ability points. No Look at Dead Eye for 1 ability point. Ability Bucket 2. Fearless, zero ability points. Identifier, zero ability points. Protected, zero ability points. I've actually only used Protected, I think, the only time I've ever used it, I believe was last year, with a Dan Marino, like, silver, what is that, um, Team Diamond Master card? That's the only time I've ever used Protected. Tell me down below if you guys have used Protected and how successful it is for you. I have not used it much, much at all. Tier 3 Ability Bucket, Pass Lead Elite, 2 Ability Points, High Rail Master, 2 Ability Points, No Look Dead Eye, 1 Ability Point. For my man with the name, the name I can't say, X Factor, he gets Shut Down, 1 Ability Point, Avalanche, 1 Ability Point, Ability Bucket 1, Mid Zone KO, 1 Ability Point, Deep In Zone KO, 1 Ability Point, Crusher, 1 Ability Point. He also gets Ability Bucket 2, Lurker, 0 Ability Points. Enforcer and Inside Stuff are all free in his Ability Bucket 2. For his Ability Bucket 3, he gets Mid Zone KO, 1 Ability Point. Deep End Zone KO, 1 Ability Point. And Crusher for 1 Ability Point. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my beautiful face off the screen with my beautiful, crazy, awful beard trim. For Limited Time Kyle Pitts. X-Factor is double me for one ability point, and 
uh, Ankle Breaker for one ability point. He also gets um, Deep In Elite at uh, Tier Bucket 1 for one ability point, Route Tech for one ability point, and Mid In Elite for one ability point. His free abilities you get is Deep Out uh, Elite, Short In Elite, and Playmaker. For his uh, tier, uh, tier 3 ability bucket, he does get Deep In Elite 1 ability point, Route Tech 1 ability point, and Mid In Elite 1 ability point. So overall, not a bad card. None of these cards are bad. Definitely some W's right there by EA Sports. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.